All right, so I got something pretty cool for you today. We have a projector in my kids' playroom that we utilize for video games. I utilize for video games, and the kids, of course, utilize for their show uh, Frozen or any movies or anything they want to watch. This is just a plain wall. I've done nothing to it. What you can see as you get close, those square lines, and that's actually the drywall tape that's coming through. And so what I wanted to do to get an even better picture, and this is with the lights on, and the picture's okay, and I'll show you guys with the lights off. <clears throat> it gets even better. Uh, so it's a pretty good picture, but again, as you get closer, and you can kind of see it from a distance too, but I'll bring you guys up close, you can see those square drywall tape lines that kind of come through. So what we wanted to do is to paint this wall so that uh, it gets a clearer, even clearer picture and we can get better quality pictures for gaming sessions and movies out of it. So I went down to Sherwin-Williams. I highly recommend Sherwin-Williams. They have some of the best paint out there instead of going to Home Depot or Lowe's, although you could probably find some good products there. I've always been very happy with Sherwin-Williams. I know they don't pay me to say that, but this is a emerald, their emerald line. It's a flat, extra white. It has a slight bit of gray in it, which you'll see is recommended from most uh, projector uh, enthusiasts uh, to utilize. And we have a soft white uh, or soft woven roller here. And this specific roller is used because of its uh, very short woven um, texture here so that you're not getting lint and everything else on the wall because that will show up very uh, plainly on uh, the projector screen. So what we're going to do is we're going to tape this off with some painter's tape and we are going to start painting and rolling this one wall. We're going to do two coats and then I will show you guys the difference with the same movie once that's done. So uh, if you have a, they sell paint for projectors specifically for walls that can range into the hundreds and hundreds of dollars uh, for half gallons even, believe it or not. Um, I didn't want to go that far. I wanted to do something more um, just to get a better picture, but I don't need movie theater quality. I've just got an Epson uh, projector here. Uh, maybe runs about 300 bucks. Uh, not a very expensive projector, but it's great for the kids because they can go run up, slam on the wall, touch their favorite characters, um, which we can't do on the LCD TV, but they can do on this wall here. So, uh, didn't want to spend that kind of money uh, and not sure you would even get that much better of a picture utilizing that paint than you can get with the Sherwin-Williams. But uh, let me go ahead and get things taped off and painted and I'll show you the difference. I just want to show you the taped off. So we got the ceiling taped off. We've got the corner to the outlet and down here. And the reason why I went so low below the screen is because there's a four by three option as well, which makes the screen go down further, which the kids enjoy. So I'm gonna go ahead and do that area. Obviously to really make this look nice, you could put some wood bordering or something along those lines. But for this application for a kid's playroom, it's gonna be perfect and for my playroom, at night when the kids go to bed and play a video game, this will work just fine. So now you can see the finished product playing the same scene, the scene earlier, far darker than previously, a lot more crisp and clear. So this is what it looks like uh, now that I've done about three coats of Sherwin-Williams. So you can see the beige color now compared to the whiteness of the Sherwin-Williams and uh, obviously I need to put some border and trim around that to make it look acceptable but you can just see how brilliantly white it is. So perfect for projection and the imperfections that we saw before uh, barely visible if anything at all, no more lines to the wall, anything along those lines. So, very happy with the project. Go check it out if you have a projector want to do it for yourself. 
Until next time, fill your brains.